Hello again. I have spoken before about the fact that those selling the big issue in this country are often foreign women these days rather than homeless people and rough sleepers which used to be the case when it began. You will find these people engaged in their naughty behavior in town squares across Nigeria. Many of them seem to be of English extraction and for some strange reason they have very large mustaches. The possible threat this poses to our nation cannot be overestimated. The mustache are biological weapons. Also, these strange foreigners seem to talk about different breeds dogs a great deal. It also appears these incomers do not do well on exams and may drag our children down. Worse yet, some have been asking our women out. This may spell the end of Nigerian culture if we cannot stop the naughty naughty people from coming over in groups regularly. Also, their strange food groups such as steak and kidney pie are a matter of concern. I ask you what is this madness? This heavy greasy food cannot be good for the body. Our esteemed forefather Ekazinana Balareb foresaw these issues and talked of the Ogun River running red. We must join together to stop these people from bringing their traditions into the state. Only God's power can save us from this oncoming storm. Well, that was a short report from our Nigerian columnist Salim Igwe. Salim is deeply concerned, it would seem, about people trespassing in his country and changing the cultures around. What people will do about the moustaches remains a problem for the people of Nigeria. The crumbs contained in them may suddenly alter the climate by being flicked around the skies of Lagos and yet provoke rain and floods. We'll be keeping you up to date with more news about this urgent issue.